Hello everyone, this is Crashlands and we are back. Um, this last time we actually played Disappeared. We have... Yeah, it's Procket. That's how I named it. This is a sad cat. We have a new pet. Unfortunately, I'm also a bit mad because... A little cute... What were they called? Um, uh, let me actually see this for a sec. Uh, not this one. This one. Snorbles! Yeah, the Snorbles don't really seem to drop their eggs. What can I say? They are not laying them anywhere. They are eggless or something. Or maybe just the RNG gods are screwing with me. Because I have so many, I guess, um, Snorbles parts. I can, I can build like a palace about now. I think I'm close to about 800 or maybe a thousand pieces of them. I don't know. Mats, I mean. Doesn't really matter. We just don't seem to be able to get an egg. I don't know, maybe a quest gives it, I don't really think so, but... Oh well, I guess that's that. We have all the rest of them except it. And uh, well, let's go ahead and do our thing. I already have this on tracking, so I know if I get it. So this is the map. We uncovered a bit of it. I guess like mostly the center of it. We have a few quests already made. I think we're supposed to go over here. We're not. Not there. Where was that uh, Fibron factory? Should be a sign. I think I set up a sign. Didn't I set up a sign? Yeah, there we go. This is where we need to go. We have like two quests already here, already made. We found the goal that we didn't, which we didn't really know how to take. Okay, this is not the Burbus. This is one of the gray ones. We're gonna get it. I shouldn't have done that, but oh well. This is a bit tougher to get. Oh yeah, and since last time we actually played, we have some new toys. I think the weapon you already knew about. But I'm pretty sure you did not know about the armor. So we have new armor on us. Okay, go away. There's two of you and there's like one only one of me and my pet, so that's not entirely fair. Right. Let me let me help you there. There we go. <laughs> nice and neat. Let's refinish that. Oh, there's another one. Eh, maybe this one's gonna drop the egg, right? And so on and so forth. That's 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 how it went. Like, look at this. It's like 854 pieces, not to mention the 400 of this sort of type, and so on and so forth. We have a new thing, thing. So let me show you. We have a new one of these, a new splint travel, whatever that is, splint travel. There we go. And with it, we can actually um, harvest most of this. This so this type of um, hair, whatever thing is bog hair or something so this bog hair we couldn't really harvest until now now we can because it's like the new type of um, I guess tool also we have all this I haven't for the life of me managed to actually make uh, an epic one a purple one just the blues and they're not even that external but they're good they give a lot of uh, plus life and uh, some uh, resistances and that's about it the weapon I had a few of them, about three blue, and this is the best of them all as far as I could, um, well, I guess get. I didn't really quite try to make any more of them because I'm pretty sure the game is going to advance and we're just going to change the, um, uh, I guess, the, the items anyways. And I kind of stopped at the blue. You get them f mostly from sad get parts, so keep that in mind. Okay, now let's talk with this guy. This wanted, this dude wanted, wow, that's a big one. We can actually kill it. We did it so before, but it's kind of tough, so I'm just gonna leave it there. I'm not gonna attack it if I can. So, uh, let me finish my DPS, and um, this guy wanted the gold. I'm gonna show you in a sec where you can get the gold. Excellent! One moment while I bedazzle this, bar this barren place. Okay, you bedazzle it. That ought to keep them out, though it may attract thieves just a little. <laughs> The fiber industry is beginning to boom. My supply needs a uh, beginning, and you, disorder, may be just the ones to help. I need you to scout two potential uh, operations for me: one to the northeast and one to the west. Okay, going places, seeing things. They are small, scarce, uh, scaly islands with uh, trombites atop them. Actually, there's a lot of them. This type of things in a lot of places, but oh well. When you clear them of those uh, blasted snorbles, oh, more snorbles, place a jolly sign in their s 
scale in the scales to claim uh, them for Oxinax. Oxinax, whatever. So I'm gonna need. Oh, they it already gave me two jolly signs. Okay, don't mind. I wouldn't really want to craft those anyways. Now this dude wanted some uh, weird thing within a sad cat, sort of like a, like a parasite which was actually living inside a sad cat. Not a specific sad cat. You just needed to kill a bunch of them until it actually dropped. We dropped it by chance because we didn't really have the sad cat egg. <laughs> so we first got that the, the parasite thing, and then we got uh, the egg, and we've um, already hatched the egg. And we also needed parts from the sad gats to make our items. Wow, we found your gross tissue sample thing. It, it, it tried to grab me. Oh, it has a mind of its own. There, there, there it is. That's the weird thing. Hmm, yeah, this one is still alive. Still lively, actually. Looks like it's, um, it's reaching toward you, ox. Okay, I guess he's ox. Do not let that fleshy uh, mass touch me. Ox, this thing has uh, broken blood vessels that must have been plugged right into its sad gut host. Sad gut has blood? Okay. A connection like that could let it grow in and feed, even influence the sad gut's behavior with uh, hormones. He's actually right. Are you saying this little uh, flesh ball flux found can control the minds of sad gats? Not mind control exactly, but something like it. Uh, whatever this thing is, it's aggressive as a rainball wampet. <laughs> Raging, actually. Raging ball wampet. We must uh, discern the scope of this infestation. Flux uh, dissect some uh, bumblies among the box skin and see if you find the same tissue in them. Yeah, these are the m mustachio ones, if I'm not wrong. The weird dudes which attack you with their head and give electricity all around. Uh, let's hope it ain't that bad. So we have an endemic on our hands. Okay. I guess it's an endemic. Oh, there we go. The thrombite sites are actually pretty close. We also have, can already go to uh, Torchinax and actually we should do that just now and talk, I think, one of the people inside of it or something like that and they should direct us to that weird looking, uh, not weird looking, to that specific area, like the old town that we are actually looking for. Mm -hmm. Tocho we need a moment of your time. <laughs> Tocho -cho -cho. you must come uh, hurling the fall of clicks. I assume that was your doing. We didn't. Uh, what Flux means to say is that we totally did just vanquish your enemy. Boom. Favor. <laughs> All right, and now we need some information in return. Where is this? Uh, where is the Krakalaka? That's the ancient city we are looking for, or something like that. That ancient artifact. What would you aliens want with the Krakalaka? Fuego is going to use it to blow up the planet or something. I don't know. Definitely something really bad. Then I must uh, enlist your mercenary skills once more. First, you must prepare. Really? Take the these Granville plants plans. Uh, from it you can fashion armor and weaponry worth, worthy of a true disorder of Tochochinax. Okay. We should be careful, Flux. We won't be able to startle... Um, we won't be able to startle the package out of him like uh, last time. What now? I get what he's saying, but I, I'm pretty sure I didn't read it correctly. We won't be able to startle the package out of him uh, like last time. Okay. Uh, oh, his meaning Wekodoko, I think. It would be uncomfortable losing someone as useful as you. Show me you are really, you are ready by crafting a grumble, grumbler, okay? And I will point the way. Okay, whatever that is. Well, I think this is a uh, grumble. I think this is like the next, maybe at least, it's like the next working table. You still need some of these mustache, mustaches from those things. Rumbles or something. They're like the old um, last type of, um, I guess, enemies we can find around. Uh, we're gonna need to go to this refuge. We did discover it. We didn't talk with her though. That's like the last quest we actually have that we didn't really quite uh, complete. These are the sad gats, in case you didn't know. This is the bug, in case you didn't know. And I'm not going the right way, am I now? Yep, I'm not, but I seen a tentacle and I'm gonna go for it. There are the Bowley or Bumbly or whatever. 
Oh yeah, and I actually went just perfectly. This is the structure from which you can get the gold. That sort of uh, dead tree thingy. So I'm gonna need to kill a bunch of these guys, right? Well, don't mind if I do. This is a tough one. I don't think I actually fought any uh, one of those ever. I don't even know for sure. And there we go, but no mustaches. Ah, uh, give me your mustache, will you? There we go with his balls all over the place. Those balls are actually right annoying. There we go, they give a lot of damage. Oh well, we have parasites to take, so... No, taking parasites, places to be, things like that. The bug is pretty awesome with, with that sort of stuff. Replenish the DPS. Yeah, that thing, sort of a mechanical uh, object, sort of, I don't know. Technological or something. Ooh, so his head does about 100 damage. A lot of horns, but no mustaches. I need three more mustaches, dudes. Come on already, give me your hairs, I guess. That sounded weird. Oh, and we have two of them on our tail, I suppose. Come on, one pet, do your thing. There we go, one's down. This one's with his orbs of energy. Come on, you swami, you, whatever you are. Execute that. And we got one mustache, I think. Ah, these are the snorbles, don't really necessarily like them, right about now, but I do need them to take their egg, so come on snorbel, give me your pet or something, I'm your child, your unborn child, yeah. Think about it, you're getting his unborn child and actually mad that he's not giving it to you. That's not mean, I don't know what it is. Kinda sick as well. So we should go for, you know, frack him. We're gonna go for the quest for now, and we're gonna go from there, we'll see how it goes. It actually crap. <laughs> I would actually attack that one, but he'd sort of uh, have a lot of guys nearby. He's gonna be a lot of fighting with it. It's sort of like a Wampy Lord, for those that's actually seen the series. Uh, when we actually got to the Wampy Lord, it wasn't necessarily an easy fight. Not that that one, that one of a f uh, tough one, but it wasn't that easy either. Go away, Wego. You're annoying as hell, as usual. Go, no mustaches though. Maybe this one. Come on, mustache away. Crap, I thought I was going to kill it. You and his guided missile head, I guess, because that's what he used. <laughs> Let's get this one because he's in the way. You stay there. Don't you come nearby. Keep your mustache there. Don't tickle me. I guess maybe that's what he's actually trying. <gasps> there we go, we actually got it. Wow, we have a complete quest without really even one thing to, to have it. That was actually quite easy. Normally it takes a lot more time than this. Wow, there's a lot of spheres of energy. The one pet that is tank, but unfortunately... Oh, there's actually a pond on... Not a pond, but a fishing hole. Oh well, whatever. Look at all of this strombite stuff. So this is the structure you need to cut down. Well, with this... So, Sprinter Travel, without that you ain't gonna be able to actually harvest it. Now let's talk with this thing, because apparently we're supposed to. Who goes there, I suppose? <laughs> that you, Rampolo? Rampolo? Rampolo, yeah. I swear I'll stab your mustache right off. So I guess Rampolo is sort of a boss of the mustache thingies. Steady, we're here to bring you home. Home? This is my home now. Okran can roll, double timing someone, double... Tim, Tim, timing, and rot. Oh, so Okran can rot. Double something. <laughs> Someone is one thing, but um, quadruple timing. Whatever timing is, he even uh, has the mind for that. Okran has been absorbed. The new rooster seems well. He's just as double time, but maybe less quadruple time. <laughs> Sounds like a stand-up uh, backstabbing burbus to me. <laughs> but if you came this far to find me, the new rooster must be desperate. I do not jump at the request of a desperate burbus. You're in the middle of nowhere, a way steep in uh, box skin. Yeah, that's box skin, all right. Yes, but I came here for my own uh, volition, so uh, I propose a deal. Right, of course you do. <laughs> What did the uh, what what would get you to move uh, Xakak? <laughs> Two simple simple things. First, the enormous bumbly Rompalo 
has been uh, stepping my foot, stealing my food, not my foot. Oh my god, I'm really bad at reading, especially since I'm very tired. And apparently I should have washed my eyes or something, because they're sort of cloggy. I must know that um, where I am headed has better security than, our, uh, than uh, her out. Uh, take her. Oh my god. Maybe you should actually stop reading this. So I'm... Um... Oh, let's start over. First, the enormous bumbly Rumpalo has been stealing my food. I must know that where I'm headed uh, has better security. Uh, security. Take her out. What makes you think that I'm the security of that place? Oh well. The second thing. Bring me a piece of gold. Yeah, gold. And then I'll consider it. We have a lot of gold already. If we came back and you put a burbus by asking for something else, I swear I'll beat you with my antenna. <laughs> you don't have one. <laughs> Let's go. Where in God's name is this bolly thing? Yeah, we're in the box. That I already know. I really want to get a piece of gold so you actually can see it. Because I already only said to you how you can get the gold, but it didn't really quite show you. So, yeah, you know, and, uh, have proof of life, sort of. Here we go, no gold, and where's that bolly thing? Oh, maybe it's shown us on the map, and I'm like a dumbass. It could be I'm a dumbass, it happens, you know. I do hell, I kinda hate all these trucks, because they're really aggressive, I don't really wanna fight them, because I don't really care about them that much. So, no bolly? Only these two areas? Yeah, apparently, so we already have a quest made, we could just... Visit the other areas if we can get this mustache, mustache thing like right fast. This is a bad one. We've killed them before, but that's a pretty decent hard fight actually. Even with our current weaponry. So we had some bollies around here. I kind of killed them. Come on, did they respawn or something? Please, <laughs> please be around. You know, don't or I don't think that. No, no, I fought them uh, at night, so they don't go out. Uh, nightish, you know, at night. Nightish. Don't mind me, I'm just weird today, apparently. Let me see the map. We're in the right place. We fought them somewhere around, but they don't really seem to be anymore around. Oh my god, did they go extinct? Oh, there they are. At least one of them. But this one's not the one they were actually talking about, it's just a normal one. So it's quite maybe that gonna be sort of a random uh, I don't know uh, we're gonna find him randomly probably or something by the way this tech is really good we we did some more uh, we have one on us with poison but I wasn't really over impressed especially since it was poisoning everything on the screen the most part at least that wasn't good because you were fighting one thing and then all of a sudden you were fighting like all of them. Stab something? Stash something. Mustache or something. I don't know, whatever. This is sort of a big one. I'm, uh, I would say I'm quite afraid of it. He should be much tougher. Uh, more damage and stuff like that. And hopefully he's not gonna one shot us or anything. Other balls. You can keep your balls, dude. I don't want your balls. Nobody wants your balls, for God's sakes. Hopefully we're not gonna be... Crap, crap, crap. There we go. We had got hit by like two of those energy thingies. He's gonna come to me. And he's done for him. We got the mustache as well. Bumbly flight something. <laughs> oh, Rampalo. There we go. Well, we're gonna need this one first. Why? Because that one's dangerous. You again? Well, not you again, but you. So if you stay in one place enough time, apparently you will find it eventually. That's a bigger area of effect, it seems. <gasps> That's not good. That's not good. Go away. Go away. I don't really see me at all fighting both of them. Well, my Wampet is really doing a good job. Follow. Take some crap to your head. Come to me then. Yeah, you jumpy jumpy. I'm just gonna bring my own balls to the table. There we go, they're floating around me and all. Oof! Wow, that was close. I don't know how much he hits. I don't really want to find out either. 
really doing some good timing over here. We're fighting sort of a mini boss. We're also uh, made like already, I guess not made, but given like three quests already. Crap, I thought I. I'm right between them, but I didn't really quite care. And we actually can make this as well. How would it be if this little thing would actually give me the Snorbel egg? Nah, a burnt is not gonna be the case. Come on, give me for God's sakes one of those gold pieces. No. And more no. My god, we have like 30 something pieces on us, but it seems they don't really wanna come out or anything. There we go, that's not it either. What in God's name do you snorbel side those eggs of yours? You can see your feet, I suppose, or wheels. But my god, are you hard on, on eggs? Okay, so we're pretty much back from where we came. So we discovered more of the map, I think. Yeah, actually, we, let's discover this bit as well. Let's go give the two quests. Uh, one should be around here. Somewhere. I guess this would be a much closer than when we are right now. Let's teleport fast there and, and come from there to the MC. It's probably gonna want something else. Usually they do that. Oh, there we go, more food. And three of these things. I'm I'm gonna get them. Just me backing. There we go, that's the gold. So see, this is how you get the gold. Just harvest this. We have like 90 pieces of it. Okay, this is box skin apparently. Dead skin or something. Where in God's name is that thing? I think we're just about on, on top of it. There it is. The thing was this Burbus thingy. NPC. Let's see what, what he wants now. There, a chunk of gold and a big dead rumple. From Palo, actually. Will you move back now? Impressive. Is this new rooster command such a powerful disorder? I would be unwise to reject. Yeah, because we would kill you. <laughs> I'll uh, I'll see you there. Uh, finally, let's go back to Chocho Koyenax and see how uh, Sakrak is uh, setting in. Really, I'm probably gonna make like a mess or something. I don't know. You can expect pretty much anything from this guy. It's about now. So, <laughs> so let's go back to Chocho Inax or something, whatever it's called. Uh, let's give the quest, then I don't think we have enough time to give the other quest that we already completed, but we'll see, there's gonna be a lot of talking most likely over here. We'll see how it goes, I suppose. Sakrak, Sakak actually, uh, immediately set out to find gold for the glory of our roost. Thank you for bringing her to us. You sure know how to pick them, Kran. Thank you. One burbus remains to fill this roost, but I need to handle uh, other businesses right now. We aren't your servants, Kron. We've already worked our butts off on this project. You owe us. Fine, fine. Though the job is only partly done, I will share with you an immensely important burbus secret. Oh, I love secrets. Recently, burbus philosophers discovered a concept they call... Yeah, yeah. What do they call it? Time. <laughs> Time? Really? Yes, it is another dimension in addition to the tree we can see in front of our own back. Uh, beaks, not backs. Okay. I know, I know. Sounds like nonsense, right? Anyways. Uh, those same philosophers invented a method for measuring this uh, other dimension. They call it clock. <laughs> and I know how to build it. Really? Well, apparently we know now too. Uh, zip it. Uh, he said something, the uh, juice box, but I clicked to get the recipe because I always do that and uh, the writing change. You can stop the video, I guess you can see what I actually said. Probably a joke or something. These plans are impressive, Kron. Thank you for sharing them with us. Yeah, totally. Super impressive. We'll come back to Tochinax later to see about the, that uh, last Burbus. Flux. Everything... Uh, Everything line up for the final Burbus. Indeed, you are familiar with Cyrix. I believe you <coughs> removed his home earlier. <laughs> oh boy. Y you want me to convince him to come uh, here? How? Can you, s uh, can you send someone el can't you send someone else? As you must be able to see, we are quite busy here. Yeah, you're just sitting. Fine, how do I convince him? Cyrix has an affinity for well-crafted uh, statues. Try bringing him a Goldie Bank. Really? A 
call the bank and perhaps he'll uh, forgive uh, your past uh, transgressions you have two recipes, okay that's a clock which apparently he wants made on that, really? and this one is made on the amber, yeah so this is gonna be like the next uh, working oh, not that button working table, so let's go fast back home and uh, actually, I don't think we're gonna have time to build this one though you know, I saw it somewhere. It should be here. There we go. So that's actually just a couple of seconds. So we're gonna extend this video. So we'll manage to actually make this anvil thingy. Which is probably going to be the last working table from this region of the planet. There should be another region. I don't know how extensive. I don't really know much of it. But I know there's another race on the planet itself. Well, we actually kind of found a few more creatures. We have the... Squid fake thingies, which we never visited, apparently they're in the sea or something. And also, there we found like another type of alien on the planet, which was quite weird. More industrious, I suppose. There we have it, let's place it. There we go. Oh my god, not like that. No, that's... No, that doesn't seem where it's gonna let us... Uh... Crap. <laughs> yeah, this is taking way much longer than we were hoping. I guess we're just gonna set it there and we'll go from there. Now, let's see. This is actually a new weapon, I guess. Yeah, it's an axe. We can already build it. Oh my god, it uses gold. That's not necessarily that good. Does this use gold as well? And 11 mustaches? Oh my god, I'm really gonna go through those little... Um, I guess I'm gonna call them like old people. Because <laughs> they look like... I guess we'll see, we'll see. Okay, so with that being said, if you enjoyed the clip, give it a big like, if you want to see more, subscribe, and I'm going to see you guys next time.